Hello everyone. You might have heard the phrase, a joy shared is a joy doubled. Well, let me tell you who's doing a lot of sharing out there. Women and girls. Just look at social media, the 21st century way to share. Women spend 30% more of their time on social media sites than men. On Facebook, Twitter, Pinterest, we ladies are the leaders. Even on mobile devices, social networking is 55% female. Women share in the real world too. Studies show that a woman will reinvest up to 90% of her income into her family compared to just 40% for men. And by 2014, women are expected to earn $18 trillion in income globally. This is a glimpse of our future, of what is to come. A social and economic force led by women. The emergence of the she economy. Yet, it seems the world is not sharing back. Globally, less than 20% of parliamentarians are women. In the Fortune 500, less than 4% of CEOs are female. And when it comes to sustainable development, women aren't even involved. They're left behind, discounted from development policies, even though they have invaluable experience to offer. Because women produce half the world's food. Women are on the front lines when crops fail or water supplies run dry. Women come face to face every day with disaster, drought and damage brought on by unsustainable development. It's a case of gender injustice. But I know women can be more than just footnotes of history. They can be founders of change. All we have to do is educate and invest in girls. We have to share back. And do you know how happy a girl is when you put her in school? I do. I've seen it. And I know that when she starts to learn, she gives back much more than double. Because education beats poverty. Give a girl a year of secondary education and you can increase her income by up to 20%. Education beats infant and maternal mortality too. An educated mother is more likely to survive childbirth and if she's literate, her child is 50% more likely to survive past the age of five. And education beats disease. Girls who complete primary school are far less likely to fall ill. And if we had educated every child a decade ago, we'd have prevented 7 million cases of HIV. By educating and including women, we can not only empower them to live happier and healthier lives, but we can power the world into a sustainable future too. So let's educate our girls. Let's share with them the education and opportunities we all had and watch health, prosperity and joy double around the world. Thank you.